This is the longest bridge in Nigeria, the longest bridge in Lagos, and one of the longest bridges in Africa. This is awesome, man. This looks like Dubai, some of those roads in Dubai. <laughs> this is so smooth. <laughs> I can't believe I'm riding on this bridge. Look at how smooth this bridge is. This is Todd Milan Bridge. One of the most iconic landmarks in Nigeria. The busiest and one of the longest bridges in Africa. This is the lifeline of the economy of Nigeria and millions of commuters pass through this bridge every blessed day. The federal government of Nigeria allocated 21 billion naira for the rehabilitation of this bridge, which includes the fixing of the asphalt, the restoration of the structure, and the whole construction in total, the repairs and the rails and everything. During this maintenance period, the bridge is partially closed down and the closure will affect some people that commute through this bridge every day and you know commuters will experience long travel times and inconveniences. But to mitigate the inconveniences, instead of total closure, the bridge is open from 12 a.m. to 12 p.m. for people coming from the mainland to the island. Conversely, it's also open for the people coming from the island to the mainland from 12 p.m. to 12 midnight. But let me assure you that the benefit that awaits you after the completion of this bridge is immense. This is awesome. Look at this. This is awesome, man. This looks like Dubai. Some of those roads in Dubai. <laughs> this is so smooth. <laughs> thanks to the Lagos State Government and thanks to the Federal Republic of Nigeria. I'm still riding on Todd Milan Bridge. If you've been to Lagos, you understand the importance of this bridge. This is the lifeline of the economy of Nigeria and millions of commuters pass through this bridge every blessed day. But due to the repair, people have been forced to take alternative routes, which may make their travel time longer and inconvenience. However, I assure you that Upon completion of this bridge, it's going to benefit the nation as a whole, improve the economy. So the repair is expected to be completed soon. So hopefully, the first quarter, by the end of the first quarter of this year, 2024, it's going to be completed. This bridge is about, about 12 kilometers, 11.8 kilometers to be precise. Um, I just arrived in Lagos from my second journey from Morocco and I'm blown away by the transformation of this bridge. A couple of months ago, if you remember, I made a video about the dilapidated state of this bridge. But right now, <laughs> I'm blown away by this transformation that is going on. And I'm happy to see that it has finally gotten the attention it needs. As you can see, this is the power of social media. I just want to say thanks to everyone who shared the video and forwarded it to the rightful authorities for them to take action and fix it. 